happen. I just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. In WWE, there's as much chaos outside the ring as there is inside the ring. Try working with Saxon at ringside. thinking about what to do next here. Well, better not think too long, though. That's what you call a bad landing. Oh, what impact. He's on the defensive here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Hey, you're going to absorb some punishment in a wrestling match. It just goes along with the territory, and he knows that. I doubt he's all that concerned at this point. Well, this certainly escalated in a hurry. I don't think any of us expected to see him fall behind so quickly. It's a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. But if anybody could break free from this, it's this superstar right here. Oh! <laughs> He's struggling a bit here. I'm not sure how much more he has to give. That confidence he had on his face at the start oh. of this match sure has disappeared, and with good reason. He's taken quite a beating. He's not looking like himself right now, and I hate to say it, but this might be the Ooh. beginning of the end for him here. down hard guys you never know what you're gonna see in a match like this and if you need proof of that just go back to watch Daniel Bryan versus Kane from Extreme Rules 2014 harsh impact oh shows no mercy in that poor chair it looks like a twisted heap when this guy's on look out as Corey mentioned, Daniel Bryan versus Kane from 2014 provided scenes we never thought we'd see. Most notably for me was Bryan carrying Kane back to the ring via a forklift. That's right up there, Michael, but let's not forget that was also the match where Kane went through a flaming table. I gotta say, watching this match, I'm definitely seeing similarities to the May 2016 Extreme Rules match, where Roman Reigns defended his WWE World Heavyweight Championship against AJ Styles. There it is. Did you hear that crack? Incredible. There's a lot of force behind that one. Incredible. There's a lot of force behind that one. When it comes to brutality, I would agree with Michael Cole's assessment that this match shares similarities with the 2016 Reign Styles match. Though for me, the biggest story of that night came after the match. I'd agree with that for sure. Absolutely nobody thought they'd see Seth Rollins on that night, especially Roman Reigns.
If you ask me, guys, matches like this where there are essentially no rules are one giant free-for-all where absolutely anything can happen. I like the way you describe this match, Byron. It's one giant free-for-all. And while it's exciting to watch, it's absolute torture on these superstars. It is, Cole. And unfortunately, matches like this usually result in injury. Sometimes serious injury. Of course, Extreme Rules matches have resulted in some gruesome moments over the years, and perhaps none was more gruesome than in 2012 when Brock Lesnar busted John Cena open following a vicious attack. As Byron mentioned, Lesnar's attack on Cena in 2012 was without question gruesome. And furthermore, here he goes. Beautiful technique. That's what he was looking for, Michael. In Mac what a face buster. Just when you thought he had nothing left. Absolutely punishing.